All right. So today I was out running around, and while it's not original, it is original. Um, I saw somebody had this, and they opened it up, and they have the paperback edition. Um, all they had at Target and my Target were the hardbacks. So I think these are hardbacks. They look like hardbacks. So this is the archive encyclopedia. Um, it's supposed to be pictures and stuff of uh, the original um, three movies compiled together. I think most of this has already probably been seen. Um, No, I'm sorry about that. Um, I was looking for these because the uh, the compilation of stuff is uh, from all the different Time Life and Insider magazines and whatnot. You know, we've, we've got all these throughout the years with all the different things. Um, originally, I mean, we even got the storybooks, which have a lot of great pictures in it. But originally. We had this, the Star Wars album, and I've recently acquired a another one that's wrapped up still. You can get these on eBay. I actually got this at a pretty decent price because this was what we first had with this iconic image on the back. I mean, the pages are really falling out of this thing. It, it went into the different um, the different story. This wasn't a storybook. This was the behind the scenes of everything. So if you don't have this in your collection, go on eBay and find it because this is the original. I mean, you can see how it's falling apart. I mean, I, I've had this thing since, uh, you no, know, look, 1978. That's the, it's even got my Garfield protected. <laughs> but yeah, I've had this thing, God, 1978, so... 80, 90, 2000, 210, 220, you know, 40 some years. So, I'm tired, I don't want to do math. But this is what I've had forever. And I'm sure a lot of this stuff is in here. Because it really wasn't. And then, of course, got the storybooks. Um,. I don't think I've got the Return of the Jedi storybook, but I have this the storybook for Empire Strikes Back, and then the ever popular space book with R2 and 3PO, which also has my iconic Garfield protector. <laughs> but yeah, these are all I've had these forever since they first came out. Um, some of those were from the uh, If You're Old Like Me. We had the reading is fun, and we'd get this little booklet, and this would probably be in there at some point, because <laughs> you'd, you'd get the different books, and I think I got um, Star Wars in there, um, a bunch of different stuff. I'm trying to open this up without cutting into the box, um, but yeah, it's that's what we had. We didn't have internet. We didn't have there was, there was nothing. I mean, even even the newspapers really didn't cover much because it, movies were back then you might see a trailer for something usually word of mouth is what we would get I mean we didn't have blinds here when I went to it to see it originally these are nice oh these are paperback okay so the so it looks like cardback on the back but these are paperback so that's cool so they are paperback Okay, it doesn't say that on the on the uh, side of it, so maybe they're all just paperback. Nice little cardboard. Um, but yeah, I saw somebody had posted this, and I saw it. it looked really cool. Return of the Jedi. 
mean, the pictures he was showing in here is just a lot of the artistry, illustrations, how everything came together. So basically, it's like, it, it's pretty much the original. Who wrote this thing? Can't be the same guy. This one was Valentine. Wow. $5.95. Could you imagine getting something like this today for less than six bucks? There's no way in hell. No way in hell. This would be a $25 book easy. Um, this doesn't really have a name on it. And like I said, it's literally falling apart. But yeah, I got another one that's packed up. It's just a Star Wars album. I don't see. It's a great picture of 3PO. And then, I mean, it, it, this literally just is, is a, God, this thing's just literally falling apart. So, this one, has this goes into Star Wars Seven Academy Awards? Cool. Um, hmm, it smells like a new book. So yeah, this is basically just the same. The different art, different illustrations. How Lucas got his ideas for different characters. There is an iconic image that uh, has been redone in the um, um, wow so this reminds me of the Mandalorian or no Boba Fett Book of Boba Fett because they um, how do they uh, so they use this illustration for, in the Book of Boba Fett looks like they, it's because they're going back and using a lot of different, uh, a lot of different things for. There's an iconic picture that has also been redone from the uh, special edition. The stormtrooper looks familiar. I think they reused him. I don't know if you can see him that well, but it's just. It just has a lot of good information, a lot of good pictures, a lot of good illustrations. Similar to the Star Wars album I've got. This is just more updated. And it's not falling apart. There's a god. Ugh. Character wise, the only one left living in this is uh, Chewbacca. Everybody else is dead. In the in the movies, but in real life, Peter Mayhew and Carrie Fisher are both passed on. And Carrie just had a birthday, so and there's a uh, I think it's a Time Life book. It might be one of the other Insider or something. Um, I've I've looked flipped, flipped through it really quick. It's basically her life in a magazine. I'm sure they'll just keep reissuing it like they do Elvis every year. That iconic Vader. So there's some great pictures that they used, some stuff they didn't use. Um, well, this is kind of nice. This is, wow, I don't think I've ever seen this picture. Looks like it's Japan. And it is a bunch of the different ships and stuff. I mean, that, can you imagine having that picture on your wall? That's freaking cool. So, um, if you're a Star Wars nerd and you love Star Wars, this might be something to pick up. Um, from what I understand, this may only be Target. Um, it's supposed to be on a sale. I don't think I got it on sale. But, no, I think I did. I think I only paid, uh, um, it says 40 on here, retail. I think I paid 30 something. 20, I have to get a receipt. But, it's nicely in here. So, Star Wars Archives. That's what I picked up today. Let's put it somewhere over here while I'm reorganizing, which is what I'm doing today. 
and I just got a box. Don't know what's in it. It just came in. Doesn't say what's from. Might be Legos. Cause I had some more Legos that were supposed to be coming. I'm not sure. I've got some eBay stuff coming too, but I've got some Legos that were on back order. So let's find out what this is. Together. Yeah. I think it's Lego. It's a pack. Yes. So it's more. This is a birth, uh, Christmas present, a birthday present, so I can't show you that one. <laughs> um, this is a freebie, a Halloween freebie. I think I got some more stuff coming still too that was outdated. So I went through and they had a bunch of these on their website. A lot of them were being discontinued. I got, uh, I think I showed everybody before. Either pictures or video. I've got the uh, the Endor set and the Obi Wan set with Vader and Ben. Now I got a Tuscan. We have to get more of these because you can only have you can't just have just one. So, but that's what I got today. Um, I'm going to be doing some more work on my displays. So been putting pictures on there. I'll have to do a video once I get more stuff done. I gotta still go over. Behind this wall is a shed and I'm gonna be ripping that apart and putting up more displays and stuff. So it's heated so I don't have to worry about it. Um, that's all I'll probably do in this winter. <laughs> and then I'll be getting rid of cleaning this room out and getting it back to a living room instead of a collecting room. <sighs> yes. That's what I'm working on. So, good luck, have fun, and I'll go back to work tomorrow. Yay, work. So, I'll see y'all later.